Vox Melodics is the latest sound pack to land in Logic Pro for iPad's sound library. What's included, how does it sound, and should you be excited? In the Vox Melodic sound pack, you will find over 475 Apple loops, and that's it. These are all audio loops. There aren't any MIDI loops, drum loops, or any instrument patches, etc. To grab this new sound pack, open the browser if you're inside a Logic Pro project, then head to Sound Library. Once the library opens, tap on the Vox Melodics pack, and then either preview it or hit Get to add it to your Logic Pro sound library. Oh my God! You can also access the sound library and this pack from the new project screen. Now, this pack is very much aimed towards beatmakers. The blurb inside the sound library itself even says so, and it allows you to add either straight up clean vocal loops. Uh -oh. Or the included heavily processed clips to your projects. A lot of these vocal loops come as part of a harmony, which can sound really nice when you put them together. I've been looking for the right thing. So baby, tell me where you're hiding. I've been looking for the right thing. So, baby, tell me where you So, short of just slapping these loops as they are into a project, what else can you do with them? Well, a lot of these vocal loops work really well as part of a live loops grid. In this example, I've added some of Ava's vocal patches to a grid, and they fit really well. Bear in mind that a lot of these dry vocal loops will sound quite a lot better as part of a mix if you apply some reverb, delay, and other effects. They're also begging to be chopped up and mangled and put back together with multi-effect plugins like Beat Breaker if you're not big on recording your own vocals or don't have the setup required to capture kind of clean studio quality vocals like this, then I think you'll really enjoy playing around with the sounds in this pack. If you aren't a beat maker and don't really enjoy playing around with ready-made vocal samples, then there's not really a lot here for you, honestly. But I'd still recommend downloading the pack and having a rummage through the included sounds, as the vocal samples here are great, and it's really good fun to have a wee play with them. Let me know your thoughts on this new sound pack down in the comments, and watch this video next for more info on how to mess around with sounds like this in Logic Pro for iPad. <laughs>